morning, happy Saturday. This weekend is going to be one of the very few and rare times that are my free weekends. And I thought, what better than to work on my UX design portfolio? This is something that I've been getting a lot of messages about. There's all these messages that are like, how do I start my UX portfolio? What do I do? Make a video on it. And to be honest, I've been delaying this because just creating your UX portfolio takes so much time and so much work. So I've just been so lazy to just update it. But I know it's been a couple years since I've even touched it. And so I do think it's time for a revamp of it. So I figured I'd make a vlog on how I kind of do the process and split it up into multiple parts because there's just no way I'm going to be able to finish the portfolio all in one day. So uh, this is going to be the start. I'm going to start off with the home page. So you're kind of going to be able to get to see the whole process of how I start a website in the very first place. So far, I've already kind of created and opened up all the portfolios that I really like into different tabs. And I'm seeing a pattern that I'm liking. Definitely really helpful. I definitely always use Dribbble or Behance. Those are my go-tos for looking at inspiration, especially for UX design or just design in general, and kind of getting an idea of the layout, the color schemes that I really like, the font choices. So yeah, I've got lots of great inspirations that I can kind of start running with. Now it's time for me to wireframe my layout. creating my website on Squarespace. Big raise, and that'll be really, really fun. And yeah. 